William Murata helped two women conceive a child after he saw a Craigslist ad calling for a sperm donor. Years later, after the same-sex couple separated and one of the mothers, Jennifer Schreiner, had received assistance from the state to help with her child, the Department for Children and Families started adding up the cost of the help, which came to about $6,000. Then the state filed a petition in 2012 to try and force Murata, the sperm donor, to pay child support. Murata's attorney, Charles Baylor, argued if the presumptive parent, in this case the non-biological mother, had been a man, they never would have gone after the sperm donor. The Shawnee County District Judge Mary Mativi made a ruling on the case that sided with the defendant, stating William Murata isn't required to financially support a child he helped two women conceive.